Prime Minister Hagi Genkop expressed great concern with the meagre income Namibia generates off its own price commodity. Currently, the Namibian economy is heavily dependent on the extraction and processing of minerals for export as it accounts for 20% of the country's gross domestic product. How can 10% be enough if we are adding value at home? It doesn't make sense. Like we are saying we, have, we must grow at home, grow at home kind of theory that we have. But 90% is from outside. And how can the site holders really train people, retain them, and also create jobs here at home? It considers a lot of things because no, not ev every stone is cuttable here because some of our stones, like those come, that come from e they are very small and uh, would be very expensive to cut here. India, which is uh, known for cutting small diamonds and they have cheap labor, they would afford. But um, so far, those, that, those ranges that can be cut here are also limited. That had also to be considered. But I'm sure this is an ongoing review. That's why I guess there is a provision for a review of agreements, depending on the information on the ground. Genkop further questioned why locals have to pay so much for processed diamonds whilst they are being produced locally. I must boast that I therefore have it cheaper than what I can get in New York. But I'm told you have the same price as you have in New York City. And it's because they, it's a global product. It's a luxury product which is targeting anybody elsewhere in the world. And I think for us as Namibians, we are happy to sell them at those prices because the revenue that comes back to us, we reinvest it in uh, social and other developmental infrastructure. So as a producing country, I think our target should be able to sell our diamonds at the highest possible prices we can obtain. Additional years of job creation and investment into the Namibian economy are expected as the lifespan of the company has been extended to 2031. This is after much speculation that its mining operations would end in 2012.